Come on in, Bill. Oh, man. Ah. <laughs> that is awesome. It's perfect. Wow. That is just stunning. And the water comes down the thing. Oh, my God. I'm blown away. Not only is it wonderful, but it is just so classy. It looks like a trophy. It was a challenge for us, because we didn't really know how to keep it under 1,300 pounds. So the custom stand here distributes the weight in a wide area. Usually, we use steel. What we did is we changed it to aluminum. You see the aluminum oh, structure wow, that's yeah, all underneath? Yeah. So we saved a lot of weight right there, well, which, yes, yeah. which was important. When I told him the weight restriction, I mean, it, it was like, wah, wah. You know, I'm thinking, hey, you build aquariums, deal with it. And they did. I couldn't have drawn it up my, better myself. You walk in that door, and it's just Boom. Boom, right there. Now, you have five custom water towers so that are in here. They're yeah. water features that flow over. You have a custom manifold underneath that controls the flow. So if you want one to have a little bit more flow going out of it, you can just oh, die really? it down by controlling it. And the best thing is, I'm hearing the water trickling off these columns, which, close your eyes, it's trickling off rocks. It's totally relaxing. It's everything. It's the wow factor this office needed. I mean, look at all the cool fish. Those tubes right there are actually creating oxygen, and there's a fish in there called a denison barb that actually likes high concentrates of oxygen. Hey, buddy. They have over 50 fish in there. And shrimp, too. <laughs> and shrimp, I saw actually. a little shrimp, I yeah, thought. Yeah, you see, those, those are called the mono shrimp. And those guys right there, they're pretty good at eating algae. They'll clean off the bottom of the aquarium. Oh, they're great. pretty good. And they'll get along with vampire shrimp you picked out, too. You also have a placosimus in there. Oh, yeah, he was guy. up on the wall here. Yeah, yeah, you can right. see him yeah. sucking on the wall. And they're basically bottom dwellers. They're going to basically eat stuff off the bottom. Like most um, of my in-laws. So <laughs> and these blue fish are just crazy. Those guys are called electric blue rams. They're going to get really, really blue. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. So do they change colors because of the stress of being moved from one place to another, and then they realize, hey, this is a chill home? Correct. Absolutely. When any fish is put into a new environment, it has to check it all out before it gets comfortable. Well. Like we all do. Correct. Well, what fish wouldn't want to live in this? It's the Taj Mahal of fish. They're like, this is the greatest place we've ever had, man. Thanks, Bill. It's a community tank. Very peaceful, very cool, just very good for the community. It's the zen thing I was looking for in the office. I mean, when I'm having a stressed day, I can sit on the couch and just totally chill. You're, you're artists. That, there's no other word for you. You're, you're, not, you're not tank builders. You're artists. I like Thank slash you. comedian. Part of that. Hey, I like You're artists. an artist. Thank you. You're an artist slash comedian. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> now you're talking, Bill. Bill. All right, hey, it's yes. been a pleasure, Thank man. You Enjoy Thank it. You right? very Thank you very much. much. All right. Oh, my gosh. He likes it. I like it. I love it. Not only did they meet my goals, they exceeded them, and I really feel bad that the check's going to bounce.